where would you have taken profits the first time? Um, well, let's not, let's say where would the plan have you take profits? So you're coming off of the 200 on the 5, so you got to do anticipation on this, right? So let's say, all right, let's say 2, 1, okay? You can't take a profit on this bar, so you can take a profit on this one. You can't take a profit on this one because it's preceded by a green bar or a neutral bar. That makes this bar an igniting bar, and you don't have a right to take a profit on an igniting bar. So the system, my approach, demands that you take a profit there. Now, you can't take a profit on this bar. It's before, before you have a green bar before it, but you can take a profit on this one or this one. So anywhere here is fine, all right? And you can take a profit here because that's a new low. So all of your profit rights come here. Look, profit right one, profit right two, and profit right three. That's all rule-based profit taking. That's not you. That's the rules, all right? Paula, does Christian understand? These, this plan will have you trading like a freaking pro. They're designed to make you a pro. But your ego struggles against the plan. The ego doesn't want to lose control. The plan replaces the ego. And the ego rebels. This is true. Wow, that's weird. My battery is going out, guys. There we go. Uh, do we have to pay attention to the NASDAQ, how it opens, what its first bar is doing? It can be a guide sometimes. Powerful red elephant bar means that you've got nice, solid elephant bars in a lot of your NASDAQ stocks. You, do you really need it? No. Can it be helpful sometimes? Yes. But you can just look at your stocks and see the same thing. Counter trends are best done, counter trend plays are best done with space and time. All right, space and time. So wide space between the moving averages and duration of the trend down. So look, you've got duration, long duration of a move down, and you've got space between the two moving averages. And you've got time. So here's time, and here's space. So if you were to get a clearing elephant bar of some type here, like that, that could be a good play to counter trend. Those are the best counter trend plays. The other ones are kamikaze plays where you get three wide spaces. See, this is wide space. This is one level of wide space. But if you get two levels of wide space, like this, one, two, three, this can be a good counter trade, although that one will tend to be less duration than the clearing one. Clearing one can really turn big. <laughs> 